Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a DIY video and I have never done a DIY video before and I'm really, really excited about this one because it has actually turned out really, really well. Even though there was some mistakes along the way, it turned out absolutely great. And yeah, I just really, really hope you like this video as well. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to paint and upcycle this gorgeous gorgeous cabinet into a moroccan dream and it is so gorgeous so me and my mum decided to upcycle this old bedside cabinet that we had lying around and we just decided to make it look absolutely incredible so we went and got loads of different colors of paints from b &Q. So the paints we got mainly consisted of the small tester pots because we were going to do it all different colours. So some of the colours that we chose were bright orange, which just really, really adds a bit of pop and gorgeousness to this cabinet. We also used a really, really nice like turquoisey colour and this is in tropez blue and it's just gorgeous. So those two colours together look incredible. We've actually already got, we've actually also got some more tropez blue because we bought two of them because we really liked them. We also used a really, really gorgeous green, and we also used a really, really, really nice pink that we used to paint our hall. So it's a bright pink, you'll see it on the cabinet. And we also used some gold paint that we used to decorate the cabinet with. So my mum is actually a really good drawer, and I wanted her to just showcase her skills and show you like how to draw a mandala or something just really, really, really pretty and ornate and just really really moroccan like so basically on this cabinet we have like four different sides obviously and we have the top and we just wanted it like basically edged in gold and we also wanted like the gold to also be prominent with a pattern so my mum done a mandala on the front and various other patterns on the back so like a paisley pattern on one side she done a hamza hand on the other side and then on the back i think we just done a pattern and on the top we done a pattern as well and it just looks gorgeous and it's currently sitting in our teal front room and our front room is teal with like gold all up the walls and it just looks gorgeous and this cabinet just looks incredible because of all the bright colours they just really stand out so these tester pots are just incredible so you get 50 mil in there and that will just cover a side and more so you'll see on the video that it's just so incredible that you can just pick up these tester pots for just a few quid and you can just transform something really amazingly. We didn't bother to rub it down, sand it down or treat this cabinet in any way. It was already quite porous so we just decided to paint it as it was and it turned out really, really well. So one of the greens that we used was a Dulux Endurance Plus and it's just a really, really gorgeous green and that is on the cabinet as well. So the green that you see there is from Dulux. Then we just used B&Q's own make colours and colours premium tester pots and the big pots that we used for the pink and the teal were just their colours big pots and yeah so we just used like really really affordable paint to do this and it just turned out incredibly well and I really hope some of you decide to copy this decide to just get inspiration from it because it's such a gorgeous summery piece and it's just so beautiful and I really hope you like it <laughs>
enjoyed it. Me and my mum own so many pieces of second-hand furniture that we have upcycled and we just adore upcycling furniture and I'd love to do more of these videos. So if you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also comment below if you really, really love it as much as I do and if you'll be trying this out, copying it or if you've even got a little bit of inspiration from it because we just think it looks great and it's so colourful, so summery, so Marrakeshy and moroccan -y. and we just love it. So comment below what you like about it, comment below if you're going to try it or if you've got inspiration. I hope you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment below and I'll see you next week with a brand new video. Bye!